do more block work and less hang work. I think these things aren't the end of the world and they're both pretty good drills, but one of the things I see in my own lifting and a bunch of my clients lifting is the hang can just get you pretty beat up or just making you feel like you're getting pretty fatigued in that isometric position where you're holding the bar or pausing mid shin or mid thigh and trying to work on exploding from that position where your tissues have already taken up the slack of the weight. When you're working off the blocks, you have to create pretty much force from no slack. You have to launch straight from that position. Yes, I will teach some people to just take the slack out of the bar before they lift, but for the most part, they're not pre-tensioned and they have to build that tension, which is very similar to what we do off the floor. So if we can try and find a height where they can build more speed, challenge their second pull, and then become more reactive when it comes to getting under the bar, the blocks we can we can start to see how the blocks can be such an undervalued tool in our training. If you, and if you aren't using them, I 100% recommend you guys plugging them into your program. It doesn't really matter what heights you use. I'd start with just mid shin or even slightly off the floor. And then you can try and challenge yourself and go above the knee. Usually above the knee is where I'll start for most people. And then our main goal is trying not to want to thrust our body back. That's what I see a lot of the times. You want to try and keep your shoulders over the bar or slightly in line with the bar at the start of the pull and try and delay knee extension as best as you can. The blocks are a great, great way for us as coaches to see this position and see how you're moving through space and we can try and work on what kind of strategies are you using to drive that bar up and it'll be pretty obvious straight away if you do bang that bar away so we can work on trying to clean up the contact in the pull as well. Overall, just a great drill.